here's a contraption I made. It has a screw bottom for a tripod. So I went ahead and put a adapter to put a normal GoPro on the bottom that doesn't tilt. And the camera you guys are in right now is gonna go in there. Whew. Out of breath. I really went this video about 10 minutes ago. But there was a wreck that got me behind. So you guys are gonna pop right in there and then we'll go for a walk. Here we go. Oh, you guys are almost ready to fall out of that bottom one. So, sorry, I'm gonna be out of breath probably this whole video. So, one of these cameras is uh, fixed mounted. The other one is about to be turned on so it's leveling. I'm gonna go for a little hike. Hopefully at the end. Man, I'll explain me out of breath in a minute. Hopefully by the end there will be an awesome sunset. Here we go. Turn it on. Whew. Turn it on. Sorry. There we go. Hopefully you can notice by one of these is the gimbal and one isn't. So I'm out of breath because this is Pine Bluffs Wyoming Welcome Center. It was raining. I can't really tilt it up. I got tilted up with the thing. It was raining right before I got here. And some cars collided. And um, made me 10 minutes later than what I wanted because the sun sets in 15 minutes. Sounds like there's people up here shooting. Even though it just rained, it's pretty uh, dry. Just hoping I can get up there in time. And show you guys how this does on a trail. I will shut it off if I see people. Because I don't want to have to... Like, oh, YouTube. Can I add you? All that crap. So right now I'm just holding it up like a normal GoPro stick. Whew. I'm fat. I ain't ever going to get this. My breath back. <laughs> oh, it's sprinkling. Whew. May have to hide under a tree. Scared the shit out of me. Now, the one camera's probably looking at the ground every now and then, and the other one's probably looking damn straight ahead. That's what's good about the gimbal. See, if I get tired, I can put it down at my side. I watch myself. I forgot water yet again. Pacing myself. People up here shooting. Man. I'm gonna turn it into a different mode. That's PF mode. Here is HL mode. I think it goes with me up and down. But if I go side to side. So that's pretty good for a bicycle. Sorry for the breath. Yeah, if you're on a bike, a 
would work really good. I'm still in that HL mode. That's just side to side. Almost getting that breath back. Doesn't help I'm wearing these fancy pants that don't let you take big strides. It's got a thick uh, close up crotch. Okay, gonna put in another mode. FPV, which I think is just a more stable. Uh, it kind of moves wherever you move, but it uh, smooths it out. Shut comments off on this on to hear you guys bitch about me breathing. Okay. Turning it back, because this is what normal people would probably have it on. We're back on the PF setting. Before it just rained in here, there's no water. If a bear comes running at me. Forget this video. Gotta put it down for a little bit. I thought it was gonna be cold, so I'm wearing a sweater. really windy when we're in stop traffic. We're almost there. thinking of that one movie with uh, Chevy Chase in it. It could be. Or it's like, breathe through your mouth. Breathe. Yeah. I just quit talking. Let's see how much time we got. Sunset. Whew. It's 10 minutes away. Plane over there in the sky. Okay, I'm gonna take a break, gonna shut this down for a bit. Oh, oh my god, so we made it up here. Oh, but there ain't gonna be a sunset. Woo, I never got my breath. I didn't make it out to the ledge I wanted. Oh, we had a little bit of infer interruption. Well, the ledge I really like to go to is over there. But, you have to walk through more of the jungle. So right here is good. Sorry, it's 
still out of breath. And I don't think we're gonna get that sunset. But we got a few minutes. I'll shut you guys off until then. Well, finally got my breath a little bit. That's the sunset. You can never predict the weather. If it's gonna be good or bad. But the main purpose of this video was to show you on a trail the difference. And we're gonna head back too. Well, also something awesome with this, I use my remote to control both cameras at this time, but there is also the buttons on the side that are really quick, shut down your camera and everything. But what I like is if I triple tap this, you can see how out of shape I am. The button right where your trigger is. If I tap it three times, it comes back to me. I don't know how good it is. I don't have front facing. I only use uh, the 7, GoPro 7. And if you double tap it, it'll go back to where it was. Which that's super cool. Look at the cliff we're on. I don't know if you guys can see that. If I go way out. <laughs> yeah. This thing's awesome. I can just sit here. You know, this panorama. Pretty cool. We'll have to see how that turns out. What does it look like straight up? And you can do all that very smoothly with the controller that's built in to the gimbal. Let's see what time it is. I was gonna wait till about three minutes after sunset. Five. Got another minute. I don't really want to be out here at night. There's people that do stay out here. I don't think the sun's gonna show, so I'm gonna show you how awesome this place is. You walk up some rinkety dink trail. And it's just beautiful up here. It's also a disc golf course. So uh it's not like you're not supposed to be here. And there's a uh, archery, I think, too. Somewhere up here. So let's go back. I'm gonna put it in um HL mode, which I think is good for bikes because it goes side to side, but it does not um do up and down. And let's hope we not find a bear. What is this? Oh, glass bottle. See how you guys went with me? If I had it on the other mode, when I go down, you stay looking forward, but this one goes straight to it. That's pretty cool. So if you're leaning with a bike, that's what I think this one's good for. I'm also trying to get footage off my other camera that I have somebody sent it to me to try out most people don't even use these things anymore but they sent it to me to try out there's a cool looking bush looks prickly didn't come out very good I think you guys can hear them gunshots there's a trail that takes you one way the other we're gonna go this way Cool little photo there. I do like how when I'm going downhill now, you guys are looking with me. And if I go to the side there, one of them probably went crazy. One was smooth. Cool little brush. All that rushing for nothing. Now, if you guys ever come here, Pine Bluffs, Wyoming rest area. You can walk all over here, except way, way over there. I don't know if it's where that yellow thing is up there. There's a house over there somewhere. At least on Google Earth, I seen it. But I think there's a fence. I don't even know how they get to their house. That's not a driveway. It's a, for their house. It's a driveway to 
a tower but there's a gate at the top of that so i'm assuming that's how they get there but i don't know how they get to this trail because we came in the only way i see Ooh, cactuses look at that good thing i didn't wear flip-flops I'm gonna put you guys as soon as we hit this little course. There used to be a racetrack up here. There's these little uh like that post there. There'd be something on that post that tells you about this area. Back in like the 80s or something, there was a racetrack up here. And if you guys check out my other videos, I've been up here a few times. It's peaceful. Bring a water. See how it's grooved right there? When you go to the race area, it's concrete. And they've driven, there was only one way up here. And the way they came up, they took the same path so many times that the concrete has grooves in it from the tires. It's pretty cool. Kind of like the Oregon Express or something. Photo. Okay, I'm going to switch you guys over to FPV mode. Flashlight mode. Um, that's the only one we're not going to try. It just keeps it totally stiff looking straight out. I don't even need to try that one. Self-explanatory. Now this one should almost move with the awful camera. Awful mounted one without the gimbal. But it should be smoother. So if I go like this. Move real quick. It should be smooth if I go up. So if I slide on this turf or something. I don't know. I'll have to look at the video later. <laughs> I just know I wanted a gimbal. Oh, Jesus. So this camera doesn't have a focus lens on it. You gotta flip this little thing on the side. It doesn't do awful for a cheap camera. Great for a kid. I think this is this lasts up to nine hours. I think we're gonna be going on about an hour, 45 minutes to an hour on this video. That is the racetrack. If you the racetrack ain't even there, but the, the grooves get there is there. And if you keep taking that, it takes you to the uh, cell phone tower which I've walked this whole thing and got lost because it said like hole one yeah then post I was pointing at they tell you where your next hole is and all that I'll show you one that's pretty cool up here frisbee golf and then archery whoo glad I got my energy back A little photo right here. I just had to post pictures. Let's see if the flash works on this thing because it's not really. Doesn't want to use the flash. I don't think it's taking that good of photos, but don't let that person know. <laughs> I'm supposed to be totally positive about these devices. Instead, now I just don't say the bad. Although this had a bad, um, the gimbal I'm using right now, oh, to set up the Bluetooth was just atrocious. Ooh, a bird scared the shit out of me. Cool little vine. Hold that tree up. Okay, I'm gonna switch it back to. HL mode, which is I'm gonna call it the bicycle mode. You can go side to side, but not forward. It levels it side to side. There's a cool little trail of water. Did it take it? Nope. These pictures are gonna turn out awful. And people got some money to spend on bullets. This is cool. 
Oh, you used a flashlight, huh? Looks cooler to you guys. Oh, look at that. I'm never gonna make it back to the car. I like how that's eroded. Tree, you better run away. You're next to fall. Looks like there's been a bike. Two bike, bike tires. I'd be afraid to fall. Roll on a rock. Also, I'm like heavier than most people. It's a cool photo. I don't think any of them are going to turn out. What does it look like? Fuzz. Bet my phone could take a picture of that. It does take good photos when it wants to. Yeah, use the flash there. A little flash. Whoop. Okay, I'm gonna turn it back to the mode I like, where it just kind of floats, the PF mode. That was weird. Hit the button on it and it, a cricket quit cricking. This one just kind of floats along. Got just a little bit there. Is the bottom camera still recording? Good. I remember when there was rocks over all that. This thing zoomed out all the way. How'd that one turn out? It'll look better once it's on a computer. This is the time when bears come out. I think that looks pretty cool. There's a different way back. It's the same amount of walking, but it's up and down and all around. We're a train. I hope these people are happy with the photos I take. If they think, oh, you were moving when you took it, well, watch my video. There's a frisbee golf. Can you guys see it right there? That's one of the spots. In my area, it's like a uh, a golf course. Like it's mowed so nice. Um, I actually like this better. This is like extreme level. Now again, if somebody's walking this way, I am going to shut the cameras off. Because I'm getting close to being where the car is at. Ow. Cool erosion right there. I don't know what you guys think is cool, but... I'm from like Chicago area. Everything's flat. And corn. And boring. We have a campground that's called Mountain View or something, Mountain Top Campground. And really it's just a hill. I think you guys really need to get out more. I think this is the golf tee I wanted to show you guys. It's really cool. Hole 10. Yeah, that's it. So you start out on a nice spot right there. And you shoot it way up there. I don't know if you could see it right there. It's way up there. It says it's 137 meters or feet or something. But it's normally windy here. So good luck with that. When I bring my drone here, that's where I land it. Nice safe spot.
Dave, you guys seen the ruts up there? If you look around this place, it's all cliffs. And then there's this. You can't drive up that. Not when state trooper will probably come flying at you. Getting a bit dark. I do have a light. I didn't want to turn it on because then somebody will think I'm SOS. Hopefully you guys like my demonstration. Um, I am going to be putting it on a motorbike. A bicycle with a motor on it. <laughs> I call it my motorbike. And uh, I'm going to try it out on it. Um, last time you guys seen my videos, I just uploaded mine and give a crap. Um, that GoPro did not handle the shaking very well. That was an action camera. Now I've gotten a GoPro since, thank goodness. Handles the bumps a lot better, and with this, going side to side would be really cool. Make me feel like a Forza video or something. Oh, what a hang. Really wish I brought my bike. I would have went up that with the motor. <laughs> Uh, here is the other trail that you can take. I think there's even a bench. Okay, that was a gunshot. Scared the shit out of me. Oh, they put new placards up. Nice. So if I had time to read that, that would tell you about the stuff up there. If it's the same as what it was. That was the old bench I used to sit on. I'll take a picture of that. Me and my dad sat on that one time. There ain't much of a bench now. <laughs> That's cool they updated them. They were, um, the sun had worn them out. It's almost like they just did it because there's no glass on them or anything. Really? You didn't use your flash on that one? Come on. Huh. Flash actually turned out pretty good. There's some stairs down there if you can see that. I'm taking the easy way. For one, I didn't like the guy that was parked next to me. In my car, you can hide everything in the trunk, and the only way to get into the trunk is with the key fob. There's no pull handle or emergency pull or nothing. There's some stairs. So when I get somewhere, I put all my extra GoPro stuff in there. Um, the stuff I use to pull the GoPro footage. And they see me move everything. So I'm like, oh, am I going to get robbed when I get back? Okay, we're coming around the bend. Well, that was pretty. One more photo for the camera. There we go. Them people should be happy. Now where's my thing to show you guys off? There it is. I'll walk you as far as I can. Should we try a new mode? I kind of am liking the um, FPV mode. It's just a... There's something like freaking following me or what? It thinks that's level though. So you don't have any control of where it sits on that one. It wants you to stand it straight up, which is no problem. I don't even know if I got the other one standing straight. <laughs> I just kind of threw it together to get to the top of the mountain. Well, I call it a mountain. Hopefully it's just smoother. Quit kicking rocks. I hear echoes. Freaking birds, man. Don't you know I'm out looking for bears? There's another one in Frisbee Golf things. Right there. Way up there. You know when people get hurt. 
don't know if there's tournaments or what. I don't think I could find the next hole after seeing one because we're at number 10. And they go clear up in there. I don't know if the archery is really still here, but you could, uh, the post said archery, but they were totally rotted out. And the, it was shooting into hay bales with um, boards on both sides to hold the bales up. And them things were like decayed away two years ago. I haven't seen them since. There's that tower I was telling you about that that trail takes you to. Looks like they added another one. 5G. Sometimes there's even a teepee they put up here, which is cool. There was another, another golf course. That other course I would have taken just takes you up there and brings you back. I wasn't going in no trees. That guy is still next to my car. Oh, that other one. Right there. The Frisbee golf course. Okay, hopefully this helps someone out. If not, I don't even know if I'll allow commenting because that breathing had to be awful. I was trying to get a shot though. Thanks for watching. Guess that doesn't shut it off, does it?